Hello everyone, welcome back to Infigam. Today in this video, we are going to solve another very very interesting and challenging question from radical equations. Here we have to find out real solutions only. So let's get started. I will write equation x cube minus 4 cube is 64 over 2 power 7 is 128. Right hand side we will write cube root of x over 2 plus 1. Now I will take 128 to the RHS or multiply both sides by 128. We will get x cube minus 64. This will be equal to 128 times cube root of x over 2 plus 1. Now we can factor 128 as x cube minus 64 as it is. Then I can write 128 as 32 times 4. Then we have cube root of x over 2 plus 1. Now this 4, we can write this is cube root of 64. Then we have cube root of x over 2 plus 1. Now we can club these two radicals. So I can write 32 times cube root of 64 times x over 2 plus 1. Let me write here 32 times cube root of 64 times x over 2 plus 1. Left hand side is x cube minus 64. Now I will simplify this radicand part. 32 times cube root of 64 times x over 2 will give us 32x plus 64. And LHS is x cube minus 64. Now I will assume our substitution. Let's say this radicant equal to y cube. So I can write our equation x cube minus 64. This will be equal to 32 times cube root of y cube. Now cube root and cube will be cancelled out. We will get x cube minus 64 equal to 32y. This is our first equation or equation number 1. Now from this substitution itself, we can write 32x plus 64 equal to y cube or we can write y cube minus 64 equal to 32x. This would be our equation number 2. Let me write both the equations here. x cube minus 64 equal to 32 times y. This is our equation 1. And y cube minus 64 equal to 32 times x equation number 2. Now I will perform operation equation 1 minus equation 2. We will get x cube minus y cube in the LHS. Minus 64 minus 64 will be over once we will subtract. RHS will be 32 is common in the bracket y minus x or I can write minus 32 in the bracket x minus y. Now take all the terms to LHS x cube minus y cube plus 32 times x minus y equal to 0. Now we can apply difference of two cubes formula a cube minus b cube this will be equal to a minus b times 
a square plus b square plus ab. In other bracket, we will write 32 times x minus y. Now I can take x minus y common out. So x minus y is common. Here we will write x square plus y square plus xy plus 32 equal to 0. Now we can apply product 0 root. So I will write either x minus y equal to 0 or x square plus y square plus xy plus 32 equal to 0. So we have to solve these equations for our real solutions. Let me write here. Once x minus y equal to 0, I will get x equal to y. Now I will consider second equation x square plus y square plus xy equal to minus 32. Now I will multiply both sides by 4. Multiply this side also by 4. We can write 4x square plus 4y square plus 4xy equal to minus 32 times 4 minus 128 or I can write 4x square plus y square and then 4xy then 3y square is left which we will write here equal to 128 with negative sign now from these three terms we can write this is 2x plus y whole square plus 3y square right hand side is minus 128 now you can see left hand side we have sum of two squares sum of squares and right hand side is negative so we are going to get complex solutions so we can reject this equation as we are looking for real solutions so accepted case would be x equal to y let us consider x is equal to y and equation number one so i will write here x cube minus 64 equal to 32 times y and our result was x equal to y let's apply this value here so i will write x cube minus 64 equal to 32 times x now i can write x cube minus 32x minus 64 equal to 0 so this is one cubic equation we can use method of factorization so i can write our equation x cube minus 32x i can split minus 16x minus 16x then we have minus 64 equal to 0 now i can take x common from first two terms so i will write x square minus 16 which we can write 4 square from last two terms we can take minus 16 common in the bracket we'll write x plus 4 equal to 0 now a square minus b square i can apply difference of two squares formula and x plus 4 times x minus 4 will be there minus 16 times x plus 4 equal to 0 now we will take x plus 4 common out so we will get x plus 4 in other bracket we will write x times x minus 4 minus 16 equal to 0 or I can write x plus 4 
times x square minus 4x minus 16 equal to 0. Now we can apply product 0 rule. We will write x plus 4. Either this equation will be 0 or x square minus 4x minus 16 equal to 0. So from our first equation, I can write if x plus 4 equal to 0. So our first real solution would be x equal to negative 4. Now we will consider quadratic equation x square minus 4x minus 16 equal to 0. Here we can use quadratic formula. So let me write formula first. So x will be equal to minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4 times ac over 2 times a. As per our equation, a is 1, b is minus 4 and c is negative 16. Let's apply here. Let me write equation once x square minus 4x minus 16 equal to 0. Let's apply formula x is equal to minus of minus 4, 4 plus minus square root of minus 4 a square b square minus 4 times 1 times minus 16 divided by 2 times 1. So this will be equal to 4 plus minus a square root of minus 4 a square is 16 minus 4 times minus 16 plus 64 over 2 times 1 is 2 or I can write 4 plus minus a square root of 80 over 2 80 is 16 times 5 so I can write 4 plus minus 4 root 5 over 2. So x will come out 2 plus minus 2 square root 5. So we have overall 3 real solutions. Let me write here x equal to negative 4 and x equal to 2 plus minus 2 square root 5 or we can take 2 common out. So we can write in the bracket 1 plus minus square root 5. I hope friends you will like this video. Thank you so very much for watching. Do not forget to subscribe our channel. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care. Bye bye.